To judicial matters now, Justice Inyang Eko of the Federal High Court in Abuja has fixed the 20th of July for judgment in a suit by former Governor of Abia State, Oji Kalu, seeking to stop his retrial in an alleged 7.1 billion naira fraud charge. The judge announced the date after counsel to Senator Kalu and the EFCC adopted all processes filed for and against the suit. Celestine Area reports. The Supreme Court judgment, upon which the former governor was released after five months in the correctional center, did not give an order for his retrial. This formed part of the submission made by Awa Kalu, counsel to Senator Oji Kalu. Awa Kalu insisted that the former governor, having served part of a jail term, will be subjected to double jeopardy if allowed by the court to be put on trial for the second time. He challenged the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, to point out to the court where the order for retrial was made against the former governor. However, in a vehement opposition to the suit, EFCC, through its counsel, Rotimi Jacob, asked the court to dismiss the suit with anger. Mr. Jacob describes Carlos' suit as approbating and reprobating at the same time, frivolous, irritating, and sought for its dismissal with order of Carlos to face his retrial. In a short ruling, Justice Echo fixed September 20th for judgment. To put it in um, the balance which uh, the ordinary man will understand. We are saying you don't try. 12 years. You know if you try for granted. Let him please enjoy his life. That's what we have argued today. And the federal government has made its uh, position clear. And the ball is now in the court of the deciding judge. There was no order of any court, even the Supreme Court, directing a retrial. And that is what we are saying. Show us the order of court, and the prosecution had none. So without an order of court, the Constitution says in Section 36.9 that there cannot be a retrial. It is very, very clear. And that's where we stand. This is, this, this is a kind of application that should not have been fine in first instance. But in our country, I pray that we grow. Because this kind of thing, as I, I was emotional about it. I do not expect a lawyer to fight this kind of application. And I do not, the kind of attention that is given to this case, I do not expect it. This kind of application. Can they go before the, the, the trial judge and raise the same issue? Do not file a different action. Stay the other case. Contrary to the Administration of Criminal Justice Act, they said that there must not be stay. So we, it's very, very suspicious. And we don't know what is going on. So that is why we are emotional in, in arguing this application. The former governor, who is now a senator representing Abia North Senatorial District in the Senate, is seeking to stop his retrial in a 7.1 billion money laundry charges on ground that he had been tried, convicted, and imprisoned. The chairman of the EFCC, the Rashid Bawa, appeared in court at the end of the proceedings. Justice Ian Eko says the date he gave to deliver judgment in the application is tentative, as the judgment may be ready on or before 20th of September. Celestina Ilya, CBC News, Abuja.